I must say, I was absolutely flabbergasted and shocked when I saw this news. It was literally a bombshell thrown by Mr. Trudeau on the first day of the parliamentary session here in Canada. And it was absolutely uh, something unexpected uh, because if, you know, presumably if uh, going by what uh, he said, this is something that the Canadian intelligence services have been working on for some time. This had was known uh, presumably it was known. And the fact that Trudeau went to the G20 and we know of all of the awkwardness that, that happened there. Uh, something is, is peculiar about the timing about this announcement. Uh, and of course, as you say, the allegations are unproven, but it throws yet another spanner into the works of India-Canada relations, which have been at a low ebb under Mr. Trudeau, uh, his 2018 visit, which we know was more of a Bollywood trunk show than a serious state visit really was was problematic in many ways. And his G20 visit was equally problematic. So at this point, we are sort of in the deep freeze. We're in the Arctic tundra. Or as I said in a, in a column I've I just written, we're on the lunar surface of, of Mars uh, in terms of the state of the bilateral relationship. Mm-hmm.